Hello and welcome to the March 2021 Celtic Tune of the Month. The tune this month is a traditional Scottish song, but it's uh, beautiful as an air on the harp. It's called the Loch Tay Boat Song. It's in 4-4 four, four time. Um, I've also seen it written in 3-4 time, so either way. And the key that I am playing it in for you uh, today is in D major. So that means we need two sharps, F and C. We're going to start with our thumb on that A above middle C and then down, second finger down to G. So we're going to play A, G, cross that thumb over to the F and then three in a row down to D. And then we're going to outline a D major chord here going D, F sharp, A. So let's do that again. A to G, cross over to F sharp and then three in a row and then D, F sharp, A. Moving on, we're going to go uh, F sharp to D, and that thumb, the reason we're using our second finger here is because we need to be able to reach that thumb all the way up to D. So we're doing an octave reach here, D to D, and now four in a row from D, D, C sharp, B, A, and then A again with that thumb, and then we're going to go F sharp D. Put your third finger on G, we're going to go three in a row, G, A, B, back to A twice, okay, and then we're going to do the F sharp D again, F sharp to E, two E's, now we're going to go F sharp to G, and then four in a row from G down to D. Okay, so that's halfway through the A. And the second half um, is almost the same except for the ending. So we're going to go F sharp, E, D, F sharp to A. Third finger goes up to B, so three in a row, B, C sharp, D. And now four in a row from D down, D, C sharp, B, A, and A again, F sharp, D. This is the same as the first part so far, and now we're going to go G, A, B again. Two A's. Here's where it changes. So we're going to go F sharp to D, and now from F sharp four in a row down to that C sharp, F sharp, E, D, C sharp, and then D. Let's count it out. So the first two notes are both quarter notes, and they are our pickup notes. So we start on actually beat. Three. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four. One, two, three, four, and one, two, and three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three. beat takes us into the B part. Here is the B part. It's actually pretty easy because the second half of the B part is the same as the second half of the A part. So here we're going to start with our third finger on that F sharp and then the A and the thumb is going to go up to D and these first two notes are again a quarter notes and our pickup notes to get into the B section of this tune. So we're going to start with um, F sharp and A and now four in a row from that D, D, C sharp, B, A, and A again, and then 
three in a row from B, so B, C sharp to D, and then four in a row, heading back down again, D, C sharp, B, A, A, and now here's where it picks up on the A part. So we're going to go F sharp to D, G, three in a row from G, A, B, A, A, and then F sharp to D, F sharp to E. Here's where it's a little bit different. Um, we're going to go F sharp, a three in a row from F sharp, F sharp, G, A, F sharp, E. And now here's exactly the same as the last half of the A part. So F sharp, E, D, F sharp, A. Three in a row from B. And then four in a row from D down to that A. F sharp to G. Three in a row up from G. Two A's. F sharp to D. Thumb goes to that F sharp, four in a row. And end on D. So let's count out the B part. Like I said, these first two notes are quarter notes and they are a pickup. So one, two, three, four, one, two, and three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, and three, four, one, two, three, four, and one. Are the chords for the A part, so we're starting with the D chord. F sharp minor, G, E minor, D, G, D, I like an E minor here, A, <laughs> She's singing with me. Here we go. And G, E minor, F sharp minor, G, A, D. Sorry, got distracted. Here we go. E minor, G, A, D. So there's a reason that I named that little girl Aria. <laughs> she likes to sing. All right, here are the chords for the B part. G, E minor, F sharp minor, G, E minor, F sharp minor, or you could use a D here if you wanted, if you didn't like that minor. And then we're gonna go G, minor, F sharp minor, or again, or you could use D, E minor, A, D, F sharp minor, G, E minor, F sharp minor,